Hello VC. I'm taking a break from recording and uh, thought I would go ahead and just respond to you, Robert Z, after watching David Horowitz's response. Uh, and I've watched, uh, I think, one of the response to your uh, question. And to be honest, I haven't seen that video, but I gather the question is, when is collecting enough? Do I have it right? Uh, when is too much too much? Um, I can only conjecture why the question is being asked. Probably if I watched the video, it would give me a clue. Um, but I'm just going to go ahead and answer. Um, it, because it comes up, Jim Cook, um, uh, Memphis Vinyl Jim, made a comment about the subject online uh, either yesterday or the day before. And I responded to it, and I'll kind of uh, just repeat what I said, which is, you know, um, at my age, I really feel it's important to state this and share this sentiment, which is, you know, mm, we don't need someone else's approval for our actions. I don't know if that has anything to do with the question asked, but that is part of my response at this point, which is, Whatever anyone does, whatever action we do, the what it's about is subjective um, in the eyes of others. We all have our reasons for doing things, and it's not all from a book of you know multiple questions, you know, and what and you pick the right one. No, it's like we all do what we do. I was fascinated with records from as young as I can remember, and had dreams of warehouses stacked to the ceiling and just rows, endless rows of records, you know, and it just um, was a, <laughs> a wonderful thought and vision. So to, for me, even at this age, I know I'm not getting any younger, do I want to continue collecting and amassing records? Yeah, you know, it has nothing to do with whether or not I'll ever listen to them all again. That might be um, an important um, aspect of the collecting for someone else, but it doesn't have to be for anyone except for the person who chooses it, okay? So that's what I want to say. If you want to collect and, and amass a warehouse full of records if you can afford to, well, we'll do it. If you're the sort of person who feels like I should only have the records that I'm going to listen to, well, do it. Um, we can all have an opinion about others' actions, but sh should I allow others' opinions on my actions affect my actions, you know, a, a benign action such as what I'm doing to indulge my interests, such as collecting? The answer is no, you know. I mean, if somehow what I'm doing impinges on the rights or of others or somehow is impacting people negatively, see, that's criteria that I respond to. But me living in my own house full of records and almost nothing else, well, that's my business, right? <laughs> um, and the other thing that is still flabbergasting me, it's like, you know, we all have our own thoughts. Doesn't everyone understand that we all don't think the same way, and so therefore it is impossible for someone to have an a correct to have a correct opinion. All we can have is our opinion. How on earth could one person on this planet be right over everyone else? <laughs> it ain't so. It's all subjective. Give me a chance to say that too. You know, Robert Z mobile fidelity guy as i see your posts and what's going on in your life i see you're a good good hearted human being who you know life your life um i don't know your story but i can see that your life is a challenge has its challenges and you deserve the best okay that's just all that that matters that that's the message I have here you 
your family. You deserve the best. You know, you collect to your heart's content.